Let's get some experience with creating, modifying, and removing a new user account. We will do this on Ubuntu 17.04. There are some variations between distributions about what exactly is created when a new account is, is created and exactly which files are there, etc. This is mostly controlled by a file under etc. default, user add appropriately named. So you can see, for example, in here, the default shell is set to be shell bsh, bin, bin sh. Now, on some distributions, such as Red Hat, this file is rather short and not very well documented. On Ubuntu, it's rather long. So let's create the account. So sudo uh, user add, and I'll say dash m to make sure it creates a home directory, some uh, some distributions do not do that by default. Uh, Ubuntu does not, for instance, and neither does OpenSUSE. I'll give the full name to be Eric Dolphy. I'll specify the default shell to be bin bash with the S option. And here's the name E-D-O-L-P-H-Y, E Dolphy. Now I still have to pass a, a specify a password, so I'll do that with S you do pass W D E D O L P H Y and then I type something and now the account exists and I can verify that by making sure entries were made uh, in the ETCY password file and ETCY group and there we go notice it is now user 1001 Remember, normal users start at 1,000, and student is user 1,000, and so that's appropriate. And also, the other information I specified is there, such as the full username and the shell, bin bash. And the group is set to be 1,001, which is the same ID as the user. All users are created with at least one group that has the same number as their username. Now let's actually try to log into that account, and I'll do that with SSH and uh, E-D-O-L-P-H-Y at localhost, and I'll give the password, and I succeeded just fine. So let's see what's actually in that directory, and we'll see there isn't much, but these are files that all new users get, um, and let me log out now. And that's controlled by whatever's in the etc skel directory. Anything you put in there, let me uh, do the A option, anything you put in there will show up in any new user's uh, account. So let's just clean up, and I'll do that with user del dash r uh, edolfi. And the R is necessary to make sure it removes the home directory. You know, so I get a warning message about uh, not having created a mail spool file. That's harmless. And if I do ls on home now, we see the account is gone. So we're all cleaned up.